Yeah, Steve, so it was a gorgeous day. It was also the first big Saturday shopping day since that big announcement earlier this week. We are right in front of the Costco right now. And Costco, you'll remember, was one of the first stores to require masks a year ago at the onset of the pandemic. They are now among the first stores to say that fully vaccinated people no longer have to wear these masks. But some shoppers that we talked to today say they're going to be holding off. If you're fully vaccinated, you no longer need to wear a mask at Costco stores in Washington. The same goes at Trader Joe's, which says the vaccinated can forego face coverings. That is, if you want to. Customer after customer entering this Trader Joe's in Ballard put their mask on before going inside. Of those we observed, only about two or so went inside maskless. Can I ask, are you fully vaccinated? I am, yeah. Yeah, it was about a week ago, so I'm pretty excited. But Tyler Donnelly is not ready to take his mask off indoors. I'm feeling uh, confident, but I think I kind of need to be trained to like not have a mask on. He's not alone. Mariat Tawuri works at a Ross store. Since the summer, everyone's still being courteous and wearing the mask because you don't know who's been fully vaccinated and who hasn't been fully vaccinated. So I think most people are being very good about it. Courteous. It's a common attitude despite the available freedom for masks. We want just to feel secure and we want other people just to feel comfortable with us. Joanna, Patrick and their daughter rode their bikes to the PCC community market from Bellevue. The store has a clear message out front, vaxxed or masked. I think it's up to the businesses to require masks. So I want to respect that. Molly, a nurse and a mom to a daughter. Just a little bit of confusion, I think, honestly. Wants more guidance on the mask update. I think without rules in place, we're just waiting. Like I said, I want clear direction. With no set rule on kids, she wonders whether her child needs to wear one. And for Molly, courtesy once again comes to mind. I'm guessing you're fully vaccinated. We're outside, yet you're still wearing yours. How come? I think we're just used to it at this point. I don't want to make anyone uncomfortable. Now, for the people who did go inside stores without wearing a mask, I noticed that some of them kept their mask in tow like this right here, handy on their arm in case they need it. Also keep in mind the stores that we talked to today say they will not be requiring their customers to show proof of vaccination. Live in Seattle, I'm Christine Pei, King 5 News.